Hello. It is February the 4th and wanted to talk to you about what it's like to go to the islands in the Caribbean where I'm putting on my mascara. Until you've been out of the U.S., you have no idea how lucky you are and also how beautiful the Caribbean can be. Um, I've been to almost all of the islands and there's a certain way, a, pers a certain persona that you have to carry on uh, out of the islands and that is firm. It's uh, the same kind of firmness you use when you're trying to train your dog, you know, you, you can't say sit, you have to say sit. So when you start getting approached by the island, you know, the natives, you know, they want you to buy something every three minutes. You have to say, no, thank you. And you have to say it with conviction. That's the first rule of thumb. And you want to leave your expensive jewelry at home. Don't be going to the islands and flaunting that. And I always hire a bodyguard. I know that sounds a little ridiculous to some of you, but especially if I go into places by myself, I always get a guy, I always give him a pack of cigarettes and maybe a little bottle of rum or something, and he protects me. Now, I think because I'm a whole lot older, I don't think anybody's gonna bother me. That's why I like going to the Dominican. The Dominican, uh, the guys who go to the Dominican are usually over 50, and they are after those young Dominican girls. Well, I like going there because I don't get approached, I don't get bothered because I'm an old white lady. Ain't anybody gonna bother me. But it's kind of nice for us women to be able to walk down a street and not feel like Somebody's gonna jump us from the corner. Yeah, it is a it is nice to just to be able to go out of the country. Now people are gonna think I'm telling a fib, but I like going to Jamaica because of the eggs, the deviled eggs. I love deviled eggs, and it it's like um, they go right out to the chicken coop. And they get that, they get the eggs fresh, you know? And the yolks are so yellow. I, I don't know if you've ever watched anything with Martha Stewart, but she has her own chicken coop. And let me tell you what, those yolks are, have a deep color. Um, I swear this coming week, I'm gonna put up my YouTubing uh, camera so that you will get such much better quality videos from me because you all have been so patient, really. You've been very, very patient. So let me go get some earrings on. So thanks for watching. Oh God, I just spilled my <laughs> makeup thing. I gotta show you this. All right, here we go. I'm gonna turn the camera around. I don't know. Can you see? Ah. And here's here's my makeup table. My drawers are a mess. Then I got this, this, this. Of course, there's a whole lot more. Now I'm gonna have to spend time picking that up. You see, I need to get organized. But the problem about getting organized is that life happens, just like it happened to me. Life happens, and you sometimes you. It's like you have to like turn off your phone, don't text anybody, just so that you can get your life organized. Oh my God, bye.